Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, I want to tell you about the this keyword, how Jasmine you, uh, behaves with the this keyword. I want to try to explain it to you. So here in our update result uh, test suite, so here we are we have created an element variable and this element variable we are trying to use this one in all the functions, right? So this one is fine. Jasmine provides us a this keyword so that we can remove this element and here we have created the element right and this element we can create it like this and we can use it something like this dot element is equal to element we can save it in the this dot element so that we can use this this dot element everywhere so here I can use this dot element and here we have already created the element and that that will be in the memory so there is no need to Again, uh, what we can say, get the element with an idea of result. So we can use this element which is in the memory that we have created. It will be in the memory. And here, this, this dot element we have used. So now what we have did here, we have removed this one. And in this function, so Jasmine provides us this dot element so that we can use it in this test suite. So now let's try to see it, whether the code works or not. So if we try to see the code works and also the five number is deleted from the DOM also. So that this keyword behaves is like this. So we can use this this dot element and we can use it like this. Now you need to understand another scenario that is nothing but for example if you use this arrow type function. So we know that ES6 representation this arrow methodology is. So if you try to use it like this whether it will work or not. So if you create arrow met, uh, arrow type for this describes test suite it will work fine not a problem. Now when you convert this one to this one the context for this one changes now this dot element the context has been changed now if you try to see here so it, it unable to find this inner text so that is nothing but here so now that this behaves differently in this context so in this context in this arrow functionality so this doesn't work so here the arrow functionality means the context will be different so in this type of scenario what we need to do so here we need to create let element so the uh, same the old scenario and we can remove this one sorry we can remove this one and here I can use this element and we can use this element wherever we want okay so like this we can use it so now this one we can also use it like something like arrow functionality not a problem and here also I can use it as an arrow functionality that's it so now it's complete now if I try to see the output so now it will work okay so now you need to understand so anyway you can write it you can write using the function like that and using this dot element so that this dot element we can use it in this standard suit or otherwise if you don't want if you are if you are using arrow function like this means this will not work the context has been changed so that is the thing you need to keep it in mind while you are writing the specs here so when you are using the arrow functionalities we can write it like this when you are using the old jasmine functionality something like that we can we can use this this dot element Okay, in the same scenario in the calculator.spec.js also before each you can use this this dot calculator like that and you can save it in this one so that you can use this this dot calculator anywhere wherever you want you can use it. So there is no need to create this let calculator and calculator too. So this is the thing what I want to explain to you. So I am moving back this one entire to this whole thing so that you will be able to understand. I will use this this. So if you want to change means you can also change this one using that function and using this this element you can try to change it so that is not a problem and here I will try to do this constant okay and here I can use this this dot element and here also I can use this this dot element so this is what now let's try to execute this one yeah this has been success so this is what I want to explain you about this how the this keyword behaves in the Jasmine hope you understood about this this keyword so just keep in mind that when you are using okay we can convert these all things to function okay and here what I can do so here also I can convert it into function okay and here so here also I can convert this one to function so that's it now let's try to see it, the output yeah it is working fine not a problem so this is all about this how to use this this function okay hope you understood about this one if you have any doubts or any suggestions, please post the comments below to this video. And if you like this video, please do support me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you.